Magnolia's place is tucked into an out-of-the-way corner in downtown Duncan, and it would be easy to miss, but you don't want to miss it. You'll find Magnolia Anderson in the kitchen. You could also call her Chef Maggie because she's earned that title. I have a Bachelor of Science in Hospitality Management, which is hotels, restaurants, traveling, and tourism. I have a Dietary Manager certification. I worked in nursing homes and what have you and went on, and that wasn't enough for me, so I went back to school again and uh, got my culinary. All those fancy degrees means that Maggie can cook up some fancy stuff, but she and her husband Donald decided that there was one style of cuisine everybody could relate to. Home style. Home style cooking. Um, we have a pot of beans and a pot of soup every day with cornbread or crackers, whichever one you want. And on our home style cooking area, it changes every day and every week. So you might have fried pork chops, macaroni and cheese, and peas and carrots one week, and you might have catfish with uh, cabbage or a gratin potatoes. It just depends. Magnolia and Donald Anderson have developed a special relationship with their customers. You can often find them chatting with some of the people who come here almost every day. Since Maggie is also a dietitian, she can whip up this terrific sugar-free angel food cake for a diabetic friend. These beautiful pies, though, are decidedly not sugar-free and guaranteed delicious. The chocolate and coconut cream pies are legendary. We cook our pies basically from scratch. We don't use instant puddings. We go the old-fashioned way with heavy cream or half and half, eggs, butter. I don't use margarine here at all. You can't find it in the building. That made-from-scratch attitude extends to everything, from the pulled pork they're famous for to the salads. All the seasonings are originals. If you detect a bit of down-home in Chef Maggie's cooking, though, now some of that might be because of Donald. Well, the thing of it is, is when you got her with all her degrees in the kitchen and me being just an old Texas boy, we have our disagreements. <laughs> <laughs> but it's all in love. Uh, we have a lot of fun doing it. It's her dream. I'm alone for the ride, and I haven't missed a beat yet. I love it. I love it.